Hi my loves, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name's Anushka. I did intend to use uh, daylight for this video, but by the time I finish all the other videos for like TikTok and Instagram, it's now dark, so we're just gonna have to use uh, artificial lighting. I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted to see my October favorites, and a lot of you said yes, so here we are filming it. There are a few products that really stood out to me. Um, that I've been reaching out for a lot, so I'm just going to share those with you guys. I'm going to start off with two brow products that I've been really liking. First one being is the Refi Beauty Brow Sculpt Gel. Now, I see a lot of people mentioning that they didn't like this. I don't know why, but I love this. Like, I literally reach out for it every single day. Definitely need a new one. It's just so good, guys. Now, the trick with this is that you wanna apply a lot of product and then you kind of pull the lid off and you have this like brush and then you just have to press the brow hairs against the skin and then shape it how you want. And it's really that pressing that locks my brows in place. Like literally my brows do not budge. I'm wearing it today. I don't know if you guys can see, but it does a pretty, pretty good job. And also if you don't clean the brush, there is like gel residue on there, which turns white and leaves like little white balls on your brow. So you do want to make sure to clean the brush. And yeah, I just love this. I definitely recommend it. I haven't had any trouble with it. Like it's so good. And then another one I've been loving is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Freeze. It's a bit different, but it's so good. I don't, I wouldn't say like it's as strong as the Refi Beauty one, but it's just, it's, it's still really good. I feel like if you want them to kind of stay up, but not as like stuck to the skin, then this would be a good option. But yeah, my two favorite brow gels at the moment. Love, love, love these. Another makeup item that I've been loving is NARS Bronzing Cream. Oh my God, it's so dirty. Uh, this is the bronzing cream in Casino and it's just so good. Even my sister like literally asks for it because whenever she does her makeup and she does her makeup rarely, um, she's like, can I borrow this? And like, it's, it's that good, it's so good. And the shade Casino is like perfect for me. I'm wearing it today under my bronzer and it's just so like easy to blend. Definitely been loving this. The Huda Beauty Legit Lashes Waterproof Top Coat. Oh my God. Now you guys know that like the Legit Lashes mascara is like one of my favorite mascaras at the moment. Um, but by the end of the day, sometimes I get a little bit of smudging under my eyes and I literally hate that so much. And there's so many mascaras that I love and that I don't use because of that, because of the, the smudging under the eyes. Like it lifts, it gives volume, it does amazing things for my lashes, but it doesn't do anything for my under eyes because it just leaves black marks by the end of the day. But this will literally solve that issue. Like you just put it on top of any mascara and it just makes it waterproof and it doesn't budge all day long. It's harder to get off at the end of the day, but I don't mind if I want no, like if I, I just some, do you know what? Some days I'm like, oh, I don't mind if I get black smudges under my eyes, but some days I'm just like, no, I don't want it at all. So I put this on and it's so, so good. So definitely recommend this. Another high-end product that I've been loving is the By Terry CC Brightening Palette. I wasn't too fussed about this in the beginning, but I only love it for like the two blushes. Like I use this every day and it hasn't even got a dent in it. This is the Beach Bomb CC palette, brightening palette. I got it on an offer as well. So definitely look out for offers, but yeah, I love it. Love it so much. The only thing is, is that I don't really use like this shade or this shade. So I don't know, maybe just go for like a By Terry blush, like a single blush. Now onto a bit of body and skincare products. Um, the first thing that I've been liking, and I actually been using this for like what? just over a week now so it's quite recent but I wanted to put this in this video because so far I've been really liking it my skin has calmed down I haven't been getting spots at some point I was really waking up every day with new spots on my face so this is the bliss clear genius clarifying tone and serum it has BHA witch hazel niacinamide zinc PCA and sick I love that there's witch hazel and niacinamide in there which is perfect for like my blemish prone skin at the moment and it's just so nice to put on as a toner. It's like a toner and a serum in one, and I use it with a cotton pad. And like, it's so nice on the skin. Like, it's refreshing, it, it just feels really good. And I feel like it's been doing its job, but it's still too soon to say, but I've been liking it so far. I did get a lot of questions about this in my recent vlog, but this is definitely a product that I recommend to anyone. Um, it's the Nude Deodorant. So this is like a natural deodorant. Castor oil. 
I swear it's got, yeah, it's got almond oil, but you know, there's barely any ingredients in here. It's more of a natural deodorant. It's a paste and you kind of rub it into your armpits and it's just been doing us wonders. Like me and my husband use it. Like we, this is the only thing we use, even him. The only thing is, is that at first it will leave like a white mark. Like it does leave white armpits. Um, especially if you put a lot, like you only need a little bit. And sometimes my husband just puts like so much on there and like it's like literally white, white, like snowy armpits. So yeah, you only need a little bit, you massage it in and like it really keeps my armpits really soft because before they used to be so bumpy and irritated and I used to get a lot of like blocked ducts from like all the deodorants I would use and those would be so painful and I haven't had them like for since I've been using this basically. It's just so good. Vegan, health, um, kinder to the planet so definitely recommend this it is more on the pricier side but it's so so worth it and it lasts you a good while so you need to try this oh my god another product that i need to like literally get a full size of i've finished this almost it's the body shop chinese ginseng and rice clarifying polishing mask oh my god this is like a little tiny tub it, this is so like, it's so, what's the word? It's just refreshing when you put it on your face. It's, it doesn't sting, it's just cooling. It exfoliates gently and your skin literally feels so soft after using this. I've only used this twice, but I will definitely get a, a big size of this because it's so good, it's that good. I've been loving this. I know it's still a recent discovery, but you know, so far I've had a really pleasant, pleasant experience. You know when you like put on a skincare product and you're just like, mm, I'm not feeling it. But when you do put a good one, like you know instantly like, wow, like I really like how this feels on my skin. I kind of got that feeling with it. So yeah, definitely recommend this. I don't know if I've mentioned this product yet, but I've been obsessed with the Rituals body moisturizers and I tried the Ritual, Ritual of Sakura. This is the rice, milk and cherry blossom one. I've tried like the green tub and the orange tub. I think I love all of them. I love all of them. And these are just like really hydrate my skin. Like I don't get any like dry marks. It lasts till the next day. It hydrates my feet. So yeah, I definitely recommend these moisturizers. Like they're all so good. And I really, I, at first I thought I wasn't gonna like this one, but it has this like sweet kind of, cherry smell kind of at the end so yeah i've really been liking these moisturizers like this is my third pot guys third pot now onto perfume there's one that really has stood out to me lately and it's the kali utopia vanilla coco 21 perfume this was kindly sent to me but it is so bomb and do you know like kali perfumes are like my go-to my favorite perfumes ever if you haven't tried them i definitely recommend them and I'm not just saying this because I get sent the products. I used to buy their products even like before I was on their PR list. And when I was on the PR list, I was like, oh my God, I was so happy. This one is really nice. And when you put these on, like literally it lasts all day. I don't even carry like the bottle with me for like a touch up or like a top up. It's so nice. My favorite ones are like, I used to always pair vanilla and elixir, but this new one is so, so nice. Definitely up my street. And I also do like pink diamond, but pink diamond is more like go a going out, like like a event kind of scent, it's very strong. But well, this is nice for every day, so that's why I've been using it a lot. My sister grabbed it one day and then she was like, oh my God, it's actually quite nice and it lasts so long. So yeah, definitely love this. And if you haven't tried Kali perfumes, definitely recommend it. They're so nice, guys. I love the Catan family. Like I'm so, like, I can't believe I even met like Huda and her dad and her team. They're all so lovely. And I also got to attend the Kali event where we all got to speak to Mona and she's like the sweetest thing ever. So I love them all. And the fact that I'm even on their PR list is just like insane to me. I love, I love, I love the perfume so much. Anyways, that's it from me. Those are like the products that I really wanted to include in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys have any specific products you want me to try or like any videos you want to see from me, let me know in the comments below. Um, subscribe if you haven't already because a lot of you watch my videos but aren't subscribed and I can see it. I can see it. Um, so definitely hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and give this video a like and I will see you in my next video. Bye.